like, oh my God, I'm going to die. Like that, that was it. After enduring the trauma of rape and sexual abuse at age 12, Madison Wilner said she began a 10 year long struggle with weight and depression. I was 283 pounds and I was dying. Once I started gaining weight and it was like, oh my God, I can't shop at a normal store. I'm not like everybody else. And then it became a health issue. Madison's doctor diagnosed her with polycystic ovarian syndrome caused by her obesity. She lost 130 pounds when she turned to bariatric weight loss surgery, but now deals with excess skin. In June, she will go under the knife to help her achieve the body and lifestyle she wants. I decided that I was no longer going to allow my past to be my quicksand. I wanted it to be my springboard and spring me into amazing and great things. Caring for Madison is board-certified plastic surgeon Dr. Rukmini Rednum. She gave Eyewitness News a look inside the facilities on the Katy Freeway where she performs excess skin removal surgery. She says this procedure is truly life-changing for those who have achieved extreme weight loss. During our visit, Dr. Rednum also talked about the importance of patients having both emotional and physical support. You're stronger with others um, and when you're going through things together with somebody else it just helps ground you helps you really realize that you're not alone these surgeries are big surgeries um, people like to think plastic surgery is skin only and no big deal but um, when we're talking about one of the more common surgeries after a massive weight loss like a lower body lift um, that is something I keep patients in our facility overnight for fortunately for Madison her family is there to back her up including her mom if you really want to do something, you can do it. And this young lady made her decision and her journey has just been incredible. It hasn't right. been easy. It's not just a quick fix. It's been three years and she never gave up and I'm really so proud of her.